Hey, welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Byron Pickett. Now, was he brave? Was he cowardly? Or was he just so fucking exciting that we don't really fucking care? Let's have a look. All right, show us what you got, Byron. The goal square is unattended. He Talk from 60. Oh, that he's is exciting. Very exciting. Oh, play on. Nicks, oh, I hate Nicks. Yeah, into the water, that's fine. Play on. Oh, could have gotten the ball that time. Pick up the ball, Byron. Here's Crummel. Cowardly. And you lost the ball. Hawthorne went forward. Torp from 60. Ultra exciting. Let's have a look at Philip Matera going for a kick for goal. Look at Pickett coming from the front. That's a great smother. What a pick up. Sorry, Cole. You can't catch him. That's exciting stuff. Port won this game by six goals too. Yeah, he's so good to watch. Kane Corns throws him on his head. A lot of people wouldn't care about that. Here's the crumble one. This is cowardly. Look, could have picked up the ball. It made a beeline for him. Big hit. One of the biggest hits that you'll ever see. That's crazy. I love that hit on Kirk. So tough, Kirk, as well. Got straight back up. Sydney beat them in the final, if you remember. At Footy Park. Look at this. Ooh. That's inspirational. What a goal. And the 10 people there are celebrating. Oh, Campbell Brown panicked and he's gone. What a tackle that was. Philip Reed playing for Melbourne. And that's a lovely goal from 50. What a drop punt. He's a good player. I loved him at North. It's a shame he left. What a tackle. That's brutal. Here's Ben Hart. Oh, he's gone. Doesn't know what to do. Look at that. I love these dangerous tackles. I wish there's more of this. Woo. That was a nice one. Look at this left foot. Look at the skills as well. Fantastic. Do you recall much of that? Because it's a it's a famous uh, it's a famous moment in showdowns. Um, look from here from he is explaining the, the bump on like Red Biglands. Tries to charge you. 110 kilos. Biglands running towards you. He would have weighed about 80 kilos then. Um, can you run us through what was going through your mind? Or it all just happened in a flash. Uh, well, I was I was running from from half forward. I think it was, and I knew I wasn't going to get the get the goal carrying the ball. But I saw Beagles coming coming towards me, and uh, so I just kept going for a little while and see what happens. And then he kept coming. And then when he got close, I just went straight for him. <laughs> and, and he was <laughs> yeah. he was in dizzy world for a while. Yeah, he was. I, I, he wasn't expecting it. Yeah, no, no. So I spoke to him at Lincoln a couple of months ago uh, last year. Yeah. And he said, how'd you do it? What? Oh, I had you I had you on a plate, you know? And I said, I said, yeah, little did you know that I had you lined up as well. So. <laughs> yeah. I think we can all agree that no matter what he does, whether it's brave or cowardly, he's just fucking exciting every time he steps on the field. And it was an absolute privilege to grow up watching him play for North Melbourne. And he was exciting every time we watched him. So that's my opinion on Byron Pickett. Let me know what you think.